Hi guys, welcome and good morning. I'm here to talk about Reflector and about Mirror X and about our welcome tool. All of that in one video. Reflector is an application that's going to look where um, the fastest Arch Linux servers are. Wherever you are in the world, it's going to take a look. Those servers are the ones for you. Now we have lots of aliases and we put the mirror aliases together. So there are a few of them. That's an even longer one <laughs> like this. So you see here, the mirror X thing is, is something that um, I have as a personal uh, alias. It's in my bash RC personal. So please take a look at the videos that were on articlinks.com. Your bash RC will always be copy pasted over with scale. So if you don't type scale, nothing will happen, right? You're safe. But put your own aliases in the bash RC personal. I will never overwrite that one. And in the end, bash RC says, go and have a look what's inside bash RC personal. If it exists, if the file exists, load it up. So that's the best way, best approach to change, to create your own alias, put them in here. And one of mine just migrated the mirror X thing. Reflected changed um, November, I think last year, considerably. And the old commands, well, they work, but they are slow. And we went back to the old reflector, but it's time, I guess, to move forward and follow the new reflector. And I've been working now like for two hours or so, investigating what's the best uh, way to, to make reflector work, this new reflector, what options does it require? Now, first of all, you see the red thing here. Everything has, of course, been dealt with already. Let's update the system. And we have the welcome app that's going to change. So Ctrl Alt W, this button launches something that used to work and is not going to work. Well, it works, but it's slow. We don't want a slow system. We want a fast working, responsive system. And there's something behind um, that particular uh, button now, something new behind the button. Another alias, Mirror X, basically. So this button, that's the old Arclinux Welcome app, will be changed with a new one. The root, Arclinux root, is what we have in our home directories, like the bash RC. That will be updated as well, and the rest is a general update. So mirror X is the word to remember, alias to remember, and it's behind that particular button in the Welcome app as well. So, what is this all about? You open up, well, yeah, maybe we should do a, so normally you should log out, log in, or you do source.bashrc. But first, <laughs> Eric, you need to scale, right? Scale is meaning get everything over. Now there is another command that is interesting as well, and that is cb, alias cb is less big. It just copy pastes over sudo cp, you see, etc scale bash rc, just that. And that's basically the only thing we need. So cb would have been great as well. Copy, bash, and source it. So now we have this mirror x thing. Let's see if it's the correct one, alias mirror x. Because I probably still have, yep, I probably still have my own personal one. So this was my personal thing. This guy needs to go out because otherwise it always wins. It's the last one. So it overrides the original badge RC. So alias um, first source again, like so, that's good. And then we check again. And this is the miracle line I came up with this morning, right? We'll just see if this is better. So that's why I've written in the badge RC, it's uh, the experimental kind of uh, uh, line. So we keep tweaking this line till we say, okay, we're now absolutely happy with what, with the result we get. Because that's all it is. It's a application. So what I did, what you can do, is make your own reflector command. 
and all you have to do is read. We just go and add, go ahead, and uh, let's clean this. Uh, that one can go like this, maybe. So, this is what I read. Read, 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 and try. Right, all these these elements, connection, timeout. Um, maybe you can restrict to country as well. Uh, country name Belgium wouldn't do any good for me because there are two two servers there, and they're not the fastest one for me. So, distance doesn't mean anything. It's about testing, 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 testing. So, read this again. See what I did. And make your own alias. You see the bash or C personal, that's where you put it. So this time we could analyze this. H is six, which means only return mirrors that have synchronized in the last mm, hours. Six hours. Latest 20, latest 20, here it is. Limit the list to the n most recently synchronized servers. Alright. Then give me return the 20 fastest mirrors that meet the other criteria. Do not use this option, uh, fine. Threads 20, that's a gamble <laughs> in the sense that, well, let's read it, threads 20, let's read it, let's read it, let's read it. Here, use end threads for rating mirrors. This option will speed up, right? And it does. The rating step, but the results will be inaccurate if the local bandwidth is saturated at any point during the operation. If rating takes too long without this option, yeah, double the time, then you should probably apply more filters to reduce the number. So, okay. So, threads 20 and sort rates. How do we sort this thing? Sort by age, by rate, by country, by score, by delay. All right. Protocol. There are several possibilities here so HTTPS HTTP and I believe FTP here it is as well so we just went for the HTTPS only and then save it to ETC Pacman mirrorless so basically let's see what I have now and mirrorless that's the content now that's the general content we provide it comes from Arch Linux, as you see, generated on that particular date. And this is great for me. I mean, Osbeck is a great server. We even have a um, little script that says Arco Linux, Arco Linux, Osbeck as mirror. It just puts that line in there, just that line. That's how secure, how certain we are that server is great. So everything is gone except line number seven. So Possibilities, right? Possibilities. What if I run my mirror X? That's the new one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now it's seven. Last time it was six. Control X. And we go again from the mirror list and we see we got Reflector, H6, latest 20, fastest 20, threads 20, sort, and so on. And then it moves on. Sort rate, protocol, HTTPS, and so on. So that's the link, that's the line. And this is the result, and Osbeck is the winner. So that's good for us. I mean, that's correct. It's one of the fastest, should be in the top five, certainly, for us to check if that's correct. So that's me, your mirror X thing, your story that we have something new to try out if aliases are not the way they should be. And don't forget also the control alt W. What's behind here, exactly the same thing, but I was smart. Take a look at the number 20, 20, 20. He's done already. Control X. 21, 21, 21. So this guy, the app, has 21 servers, just to know the difference between our scripts and the application, and then we know it's working, right? That's the only reason why we do it. And uh, well, yeah, the results might be different. As you see, Osbeck is now line number three. So Italian here, Italy wins. And well, next time it won't. Right? Next time it won't. So it's um, if you're happy with the results so after updating this thing, I would go in here and have a look and say, okay, Osbeck wins again. I don't touch it anymore. 
right? That's my idea, of course. That's my understanding of how Arch Linux servers are around here in Belgium. And they are different in the world, obviously, right? So guys, another Mirror X alias and a Control Alt W, a button that hopefully is gonna work better for you this time. And I'm off. Cheers.